One in six new cars sold in Washington are electric, and experts expect that to rise actually this year. With more demand, consumers are looking for better performance on the road. King 5's Durandre visited a company in Woodenville that could be revolutionizing the EV industry. Drew, good morning. Well, good morning, Mimi. And EV owners are looking to drive further and also be able to charge their batteries faster. Group 14 Technologies out of Woodenville says they've developed the product to do that, and now they're getting big name car manufacturers on board. It's a meticulous process that took years to perfect. I ran out of this factory right here in Winneville, Washington. Group 14 Technologies co-founder Rick Costatino and his team make silicon carbon material. This is our anode material and it's on the bottom of the cell. It's found in batteries for your electronics, in medical devices, and now electric vehicles. Their product eliminates graphite, which is a key ingredient in batteries, and replaces it instead with silicon. Why? Scientists say it leads to faster charging and longer lasting batteries. And our customers that are using our material, they're able to get their batteries to store 50, up to 50% more energy and they're able to get charging in as little as 10 minutes. And this is fundamentally a performance that you could not achieve with a graphite based lithium ion battery. Group 14's customers now include Porsche. The product will be in some of their electric vehicles later this year. Now the heart of the car is going to be the battery. And that's why Porsche wanted to invest and work with Group 14. So to me, that was a huge moment for me and the company to really get really jazzed about our material. Well, this warehouse in Woodenville is where they do research and development. They also have their manufacturing process. But as Group 14 has grown, they needed more space, and that's taking them over the Cascades. With the help of a $100 million federal grant, construction is underway on two more plants in Moses Lake. It's expected to be the world's largest factory making silicon battery material when it opens later this year. And the Woodenville-based company with 250 employees could soon grow to 500. We'll need to keep hiring, you know, hundreds of people, more hundreds of people, you know, to keep keep the sites running. And the research from their hub here continues. And this is still part of the uh, kind of the cell making uh, lab. And then behind us here in all these lockers is where we're testing. To make Washington State the hub for a revolutionary way to store energy. We're hoping to be part of a greater cause in, in making our planet cleaner, making it safer, and, and making it sustainable moving into the future. And Group 14 says within the next five years, it'll be pretty common to see their product being used in more electric vehicles that you'll see out on the road. Christine? So, Drew, one other thing. Why are other car manufacturers using car batteries with graphite if this material you told us about, silicon, can be so much better? Well, so it is expensive, so there is a bit of a cost-benefit there. But the number one reason is because this is just new technology, and this company believes it's really going to take off, as we mentioned, the next five, ten years or so. All right, Drew, thank you very much for that report. Thank you. Time right now.